kids. I mean, when everybody came down, they, you know, one of the things we would do on Friday or Saturday night with the grandchildren is, is uh, people would order bars barbecue. It was like hush puppies, they don't get, you know, uh, pork, you know, chopped pork barbecue. They didn't get. So they would come down and get sandwiches. And, um, in fact, Uncle Zenas's in-laws, some of them worked up at Boss Barbecue. They, they baked the pies that they sold. And so Carolyn, our first cousin, she got the tradition from her mom and her sisters, her aunts. And so they are great pie bakers, you know, coconut meringue pies and um, egg custards and coconut custards, and, you know, uh, and all those kind of things they got from, from their mom and they all live in this area. So it's changed a lot. Creedmoor has grown up as one of the fastest growing areas around. So. And quite honestly, it's, I mean, they have a black mayor. Uh, I think he, outside of Durham, Durham has a black mayor, uh, one of the first black mayors in this area. Uh, he really, uh, and he's uh, my classmate. We were in first grade together, went through first through 12 together. So, Mayor Moss is a good guy. Grew up here, born here, understands the community. Uh, works hard and well in it. Uh, a good community servant. So, uh, so that's one of the reasons I came back, was just to make sure that, you know, I, I only wanted to be up there five years, and I wanted to make sure that I got back. You know, Ken has always been here. They were working hard, trying to get what they could to the church, the community, the family. And uh, along the way, I just had this, this yearning to, to come back down here from New Jersey and never really feel like it was home. So I, I, uh, as soon as I could, I got back down and went to Raleigh. And then uh, not long after that, uh, Donna got a job out in Oxford at Revlon, and uh, she was commuting back and forth up Highway 50. It's a two-lane highway. And uh, I said, look, instead of us commuting, you commuting back and forth with the baby, you know, why don't we move to Creedmoor? And then I can commute, because at the time I was, I was traveling a lot, and all I needed to do was get to the airport. And uh, so that's when we moved back out to Creedmoor. And I, I'll be honest with you, I never thought she would move. Uh, you know, Donna's a New Jersey girl, and you know, I just never thought she would she would come down. But she's adopted it, she's adapted to it, and uh, made it hers. So uh, we we still live in the same house we did when we we left Raleigh.